so I have rewritten how the music box works. As you can probably see right here, there is a little visualizer here. And it's all controlled here. You can change the resolution of it. It's good for your FPS. I'd keep it at 100. Going above 100, it just seems to be pointless. But the option's there for you. You can change the sample level, which drastically changes how it looks. And as it says here, 4, 5, and 6 are great choices. As you can see, uh oh, I don't want to touch that. You'll see suppressed minor warnings too. With the new system, there's going to be some different issues. But they're easier to fix than Saurus, I guess. So let me switch to a song that has one of these minor errors. Pretty sure it would be this. Uh, you probably heard that combine, but in sound. If we look in here, you can see music box minor warning has a stereo channel. This means the sound won't be 3D. So, and it will continue to play, which it is still playing. But the thing you can notice is it's, well, it's not directional. You'd expect it to hear in, my, in your right ear right now because it's over there, but of course, since it's a stereo channel, it's gonna do that. I'm, I'm pretty sure this doesn't happen with MP3s with stereo channels. This is a FLAC file, which is probably the reason I might need to note that, but it's whatever. But it's nothing big. You can suppress it if you want because it doesn't really affect anything. You just don't get that directional aspect of it. So let's... Let's get into uh, adding new music into it. So the process stays generally the same as last time. Except you don't have to change sample rate or file types. So I have two FLAC files now. Since we don't have to use MP3s, we can freely use other stuff. So go to your Gary's Mod folder, which you can easily do from here. Manage and browse local files. Go to Source Engine, then Sound. If you have, if you don't have Sound, create the folder. Go down to Zeta Player. If you don't have this, create it, and then Custom Underscore Music. And once again, if you don't have it, just create it. And all you really have to do is just, bam, you're done. Now just make sure. There are no Unicode stuff in here, or else it won't play. So I'm, just in case, I'm just gonna remove those underscores. Alright. Now, we can go in game. We can spawn a music box, and we don't have to constantly switch for it, we can just look for it and select it. You can see it's starting to play. We also heard the uh, combine sound, which means this problem, but that's alright. It doesn't cause any problems to us. It's basically it. You don't really have to worry about anything when dragging and dropping them. All you have to worry about is file names. And that's it.